welcome back to 40 plus life or welcome if you are new my name is Veronica and today I'm going to be doing my monthly check-in for my sinking fund slash cash envelopes so I already have everything written out and I have the starting amounts already so now I'm just gonna go through each one and figure out how much I have for the month of November okay starting off with car maintenance So I started with 215 and I'm ending with 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 280, which is fabulous. And I might as well just do this as well, which is a gain of $65. As you can see also, <laughs> my stickers are starting to come off. So I am getting a bunch of new envelopes for all my different um, binders and stuff. I don't feel like making anything. So this way I can also support the small businesses out there. Let's see what I can do. I'll either, I'm either getting labels and I'm going to put them on myself or I'm going to just order a whole thing of envelopes. Okay. Home repairs started with 220. I'm now at 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 45, 50, 250, which gives me a gain of $30. This, I say this every month, but it's one of my favorite videos to make because it's just so cool to see how much you saved or spent, you know, in the previous month or this month compared to previous month, so just a nice little thing. Okay, Red Wolf started as 80, 20, 40, 60, 80, 125. 125, nope, not even gonna guess. For a gain of $45. Next is my debt envelope, which is awesome because this plan I'm Paying a nice extra payment to my Capital One card to get that going. Started with 90, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. Which is a gain of 110. Okay, Christmas started at 400 but I have spent this actually this was all at 650 but which was fully funded at 650 but I spent it all so it's all accounted for I just got to wrap up some of my final presents so that is now at zero and car registration is the same so that is going to stay at 300 so this will definitely go down a bit because 400 is a large chunk of change okay what's next blue binder date night is one of those that fluctuates up and down because I use it all the time and oh, I used it and I didn't update it again okay so this change Ooh. it's not gonna count I'm just gonna I haven't put any in my big jar in a while so just putting all my coins in the small jar, the small mason jar, and then once it fills up, I'll dump it into my larger jar. Okay, so I have 20, 40, 41, 42, 43. So that was, use $20, so 43. Just wanna um, not forget that it was used. Oh, when was this used? I uh, believe it was then. Okay. So I said 43, I'm at 43, so 95 minus 43 is 52, 52, I gotta do this this way I know, okay. Next up is gifts, gifts started off at 85, I'm now at 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 6, 
seven, eight, nine, 100. That is a gain of 15. Okay, the vet started at 140. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 180. That's a gain of 40. Next up is medical. Starter with 260, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 6, 7, 8, 9, 300, which is a gain of 40. Dental was a uh, 80. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20. Which is 40. Gain of 40. Wellness actually did go up. Start at 75. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, and 10. 110 which I believe is 35. Yes, but I don't like taking chances because <laughs> as I said, me and numbers are no, no. Prep. I actually took money out, 10, 15, 20, 25. Big purchases. Started at 60, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So 130, 130, 130 minus 60, it's a gain of 70. Okay, that is it for the blue binder. Okay, yellow binder. All right, I know rainy day has stayed the same because I haven't added anything to it. My two daughters, adult daughters, Keiko and Autumn, AKA Aki. <laughs> Aki means autumn in Japanese, so that's her nickname. So, should have 105, 20, 40, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, okay. They should both be at 105, so I'm just going to put that there, but I'm still going to count it. Twenty, forty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety. 95, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And that is a gain of 15. Okay, well, my Roth IRA, I just added in the $5, right? My last stuffing. So that is a positive. Investing has stayed the same. So 16. Next up is the travel binder. All right, so generic travel envelope started at 80 and is now at 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 65. Ooh. This is because I, well, I'm gonna either visit my daughter or I'm gonna buy a plane ticket for her to come out and she might actually come out here instead, which actually would, save me some money I think because then I don't have to get a hotel and all that kind of stuff because I have to bring my dog so it actually would be more convenient if she came here I think it would be fun for her nice change of pace but we'll see I told her to let me know she gets to decide outdoor adventures I haven't added to in a bit so that's gonna stay the same nothing for Disney and then back home yes indeed started with 200 
20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 10, 15, 25. Whew, this is slowly getting up there, or getting built up too, which I'm really happy about. That is a gain of 125. And then, well, I don't do any, this is savings challenges, so I don't count anything with that. And the last one is going to be my business binder, which I haven't put anything in either, so... So this should still be 10. Taxes is opposite. It's still gonna be the same right now. I still have to add in taxes for the month of November, but I'm waiting until I get my paycheck for the month of November, but I'm not getting that from Etsy until uh, until December 6th or 7th or something like that. So once I get that, I'm gonna take the money out of that and put it into, so then I know what my total amount is for the month of November because I just write it, I started doing it September deposit, October deposit, so then I just need to do a deposit for November. So that's gonna stay the same for now. And then giveaways, oh, giveaways started at 17, but with my first giveaway, when I, for the grand prize, I added $10 in cash to one of the envelopes in her box. So, um, so that's where that came from. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I took out the 10, so I'm left with seven. Perfect. Okay, so the only thing left to do here is to add it all up. So I'm gonna quickly add up, I'm gonna add up everything and then we'll come right back. So I'm gonna speed through this. Okay, let's hope this is correct. So, my starting balance, or my starting balance in the uh, end of October was 3,107. My ending balance was 3,475. I added in $835 and took out 465. So, let's see if that adds up first. Three, four, seven, five. I feel like I messed up somewhere here, but we'll see. 3107 is 368. Uh, let's see here, I have a pencil. So 368, 835 minus 467. Yay! Okay, perfect. So in total, after the negatives, I added in $368 for the month of November. So that's not bad at all considering all this money was taken out because that's what the Christmas envelope was for, was to get taken out. So I think just because I added so much to some of these other envelopes from, previous, from some of my savings challenges, that really helped a lot. So I'm really happy where I'm at, almost at 3,500. Whew, so there we go. That is awesome. So I'm glad this is done. And so then this will carry over to December and we'll see how that goes. But close this up. Before we close out, I thought I'd open this up really quick. I had purchased these savings challenges from Alicia over at Hands and Bands on her Etsy shop. So <laughs> I can't open this. So please do. Well, let me open it. Please do check out her channel and her shop because I love her so much. Ugh. So she has the little scratchy, scratchy thingies. Okay, hold on, I'm trying to take this out. Perfect. Veronica, thank you for your purchase, support, and friendship. Look how cute that is. Thank you, Alicia. Oh, look at her cute little thingy. 
And then she gave me, look how cute that is. I love how she did this. Yay, it says 40 plus life. $1,000 placeholder. So I don't have any $1,000 placeholders because I only bought $100 placeholders. So if I, because I just feel like I'll never get to that point. But if I do, I now can use these. So thank you for the little freebie. But this is the star of the show. And I've been wanting to get these for a while. So I was glad when to see that she had a little package deal. I am really sad though, Alicia, because these are now on sale. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Uh, no, I am really, this is really cool. So basically, there's each different challenge. There's 1,000, 500, 250, and 100, okay? And then you scratch off. You just randomly pick one you want to scratch off, and then that's how much you save. So I'm going to start one of these. I don't know which one yet um, in 2020, 2022. <laughs> Because I got too many challenges going on right now. And so this is going to be a great one to start the year off. So I will definitely be doing that. So thank you again. Be sure to check out her shop. She's so awesome. Check out her YouTube channel. She is really awesome. There you go. Double awesome. All right, guys. And that'll do it for this video. Thank you so much, as always, for watching. Please do give a big thumbs up if you liked it. Please comment below. And please do subscribe if you're new. And that'll be it for this video. So I will see you guys in the next one. Stay happy. Bye.